This is a technique that I learned in culinary school, AKA YouTube. What's shaking, ladies and gentlemen? It's your man Mayhem Loren, and I'm jumping in with a quick word from my sponsor Hennessy and a cocktail inspired by the legendary Russell Westbrook. This one is called the Triple Double. Combine two parts Hennessy VS, two parts pineapple juice, a little simple syrup, and a squeeze of lemon into a shaker. Then pour over ice, add two parts soda water, garnish with basil and pineapple. After that, you're done. The triple double, quite possibly the best thing I've ever made. Champagne on the rock, tracking the Fort Knox, Lazarus, shark salad with carrots, pork chops, and applesauce. Big pun off band for TV, which is one of my favorite songs of all time, one of my favorite albums of all time. Pun is one of my favorite rappers of all time. That's my favorite food line of all time. So there's a lot of favorites going on here. There's a lot of like top of the top. So pun is just highly inspirational. Never spit a bad verse. You don't hear any bad thing about the man. He, he was just a legend and he's going too soon. We could not find any shark. I also don't eat pork, so we're not gonna have any pork chops. But I'm gonna take your line, which inspired a new dish. Red snapper with carrots, lamb chops, and orange sauce. Enough talking, man. Let me just do what I do in the kitchen. Let me get my little hands dirty and just start chefing up something marvelous. Woo! Uh-huh. So we got red snapper, we have lamb chops. I like surf and turf. Oh, this snapper looks pretty beautiful. Like, hold on. Uh-huh. That's a good looking piece of fish right there. These are some good looking lamb chops. I wish that more could magically appear. Woo! I mean, I don't really know what makes lamb so good. It just, it, it just is special. Like, I try to give up red meat. It's the one red meat that I couldn't even give up. It's like the heroin of the butcher shop. I'm gonna use one of my favorite seasonings in the world, lime tahini. There's a high salt content in the tahini. There's a lot of flavor. Beautiful, gorgeous, impeccable, radiant, amazing. I'm toss it in a little olive oil. You know, there's just really no way to go wrong with lamb, man. A good lamb gyros fire, lamb kebab. Like, as long as flames hit it, as long as there's grill marks involved, like, I'm good. We'll let this sit. We're just just gonna hit the snapper with a little sea salt, some black pepper, pull in the lamb. Bam from TV was so fire, cause at the time it literally had like the hottest people in the game, like on one joint, just trying to outdo each other. And like to this day, I can't even tell you who had the best verse on that joint, man. Like it's crazy. And like I said, Nori put it all together. It was on Nori's album, which was a classic, a Queens forever soundtrack, that album. It's just one of the standout joints on it. You know what I mean? Yo, pun has never not laid a fire verse though. We're just gonna throw some garlic on the grill with the lamb chops, you know? Why would I not just sporadically drop a couple pieces, you know? Yeah, lamb is a baby sheep, but I don't like to talk about that because it depresses me. You see that? That sear, that crisp on the outside? I guess what I was looking for. I'm making this orange sauce from scratch. I'm coming up with this recipe as I go along. I'm not here to lie to you. I never made this shit before. We're gonna start with sugar and fruit. We're gonna squeeze a little lemon juice in here in an interesting way. Just don't want any seeds to get in there, you know? Definitely a starving genius said, let me pull this out the ground and eat it. The butter is for the snapper. This is beautiful. I want this on a portrait on my wall or I want this on my shirt. Now I can add another ingredient to the orange sauce, orange marmalade, just a fair amount. I hate to fail on camera. I hate to fail in private, but that's between me and my failure. When I fail on camera, it's like, damn. Uh, you see how this is just falling apart beautifully? This is foolishness. This is sheer stupidity. When somebody says, yo, let me get a plate of that foolishness, it could be anything you dip this in. Being that I'm making up this orange sauce as I go, I figure why not throw some honey in it? You see, it's like the garlic's in a circle. It's like a garlic seance. They're all holding hands, humming. Red snapper with carrots, lamb chops with orange sauce. We're gonna use some of that carrot leaf. There's a lot of flavor in there. Get some of that butter and baste the top with it. This is a technique that I learned in culinary school, AKA YouTube. Oh, mm, I wanna throw some champagne in this orange sauce. Mm-hmm, now we got bubbles in the orange sauce. 
Ladies and gentlemen, red snapper with carrots, lamb chops, and orange sauce. Shout out to Pun for the inspiration. That's just a different kind of intensity. I think Pun would have like six orders of this. Wow. Now we're about to get some of this snapper. Oh, oh, oh. This is a whole different level of excellence. That was transports me to 1998. Bam from TV just came out yesterday. I heard it and punched a hole in the wall. Utterly incredible. This meal is inspired by Bam from TV, Nori, Pun, Cam, Nature, Styles P, Jada Kiss, some of my favorite rappers in the world. I took a line from that song, flipped it into a dish. Yo, Pun, thank you for the inspiration, thank you for your legacy, and shit. I don't even know what else to say. Would you like to make your own triple-double? Need a bottle of Hennessy VS to get you started? I've got you covered. Head over to drizzly.com and use promo code MAYHEM for $5 off shipping. And remember to always drink responsibly. Always!